Good morning, day fam. Um, welcome to today's video. It is Tuesday and we have big plans today. We're headed out to do a bunch of shopping because um, to get ready for Gabby's birthday, I'm still not even close to being ready. It is another glorious day outside and not as nice as yesterday because it's not as sunny. It's supposed to rain maybe, um, but while we go take care of all the shopping that you guys probably just don't want to even see, um, I'm gonna show you what happened at the barn yesterday. I'm gonna share with you how yesterday ended, how a day can start out so crazy, horrible, that you're just crying, 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 and then end with so much peace and so much happiness because horses really bring that to you. Um, so I'm gonna show you guys that footage right now. barn um, our instructor actually came and picked up our kids at home and brought them to the barn so she could go down so they could go down get our horses and bring them up and tack them up so everything um, so they wouldn't be late because sometimes we're late getting here her uh, Gabby's lesson on Mondays is super early so, here and Gabby's so because when I'm on Gabby's I only had for a little time okay so this gives me a longer chance all right Gabby helping her with Sabrina <laughs> You're riding in a side pull or in a bitless? Bit are you gonna ride in a bitless, Gabby? No. Hi, oh, Storm. How are you, baby? Oh, wait. Hey. I need to change my boots. Yes, you need to change the boots. Okay. Yeah. How are you feeling about your lesson? Effects. You like that? Yeah. The Can rays of sun. <laughs> just for your the camera. rays of sun oh coming my in. Should I canter now? Yeah, should I canter now? Yeah. Let's live life without regrets. Girl, put your faith in me, even though we just met. Oh. Let's <laughs> forget about a curve. Just all that is stuck in my head. It's me and you. Both speed and my heart is racing, but I'm not sure I wanna play. Cause it only does this with you Our bodies meet, I can feel the tension Move us into the next dimension Let's just let our bodies be true In. I'm like, girl, it's like a riding machine. What has gotten into you? Nothing. Okay, let's go. She was to, um, on Saturday after the lesson, um, the girls took their horses for a little um, trail ride to cool down. And today, Sophie, it was not even her lesson day. She's like, I'm going to go get my horse, I'm going to exercise her, and I'm going to take her for a trail ride. So we're going on a trail ride. Down to the she actually just wants to go on the regular path down to the barn and then back up again. Um, because the other one is too short. Yeah, the other one is too, the other trail ride that we could go on is too short for her. Yeah, because it's just down the drive. But she was like a wild thing in the in the arena. She's like, 
to our instructor. She's like, tell me when I can when I can canter. And then she cantered around. She's like, can I do a can I do a canter pull? And she just was like, but I didn't do it. Oh, how come you didn't do it? Um, because it was diagonal. Oh. And I didn't do a diagonal yet. Oh, she didn't do a diagonal in her lesson yet. But oh, it's just me. It's just me. Sabrina, we're okay. It's just the birds. Something you never hear, huh? Now that it's spring. Well, walking up, I have so did you use earplugs today, my love? Nope. How come? I don't like them. I, I wish we could keep her. She goes home. She'll stay there for two months, and then she'll get leased out and go someplace else, someplace we can new. Leave her again, yeah, we it's possible we could lease her again. I don't know most of that. At least if she came back, she'd know all the people here. She'd know all the horses, just like when she goes home. Um, I don't even know if they have other horses. I think they have other horses. They used to own a horse named Austin that came here with Sabrina, but they since sold him. So I don't think she'll be alone, but I did actually see other horses at their property. Spring is in there, you guys. I kind of want an Arabian. You kind of want an Arabian? She wants a 16-year-old warm blood. 16-year-old? Yeah. Just like Sabrina. She wants Sabrina. Anyway. Because then they are experienced and they know how to do lots. That's what Sophie just said. But she's up there chatting away. It's the happiest. She's just so happy. Like having Sabrina to herself has made such a difference in her. I got him cheating again. So long I try to pretend. Trying to make a bad boy good Leave you for good, you know I never would Thinking it's just like a young With his inner child Then I go on and set the truth on fire It's gone too far and I just can't go back And we talk in train It's still the same The scene of a change in a Alright, 
You told me to lighten up, but it's not easy breaking habits. I've got a ton of bad days lined up, and I ain't gonna chase no rabbits. You said it's not as bad as all that. Just need to take it. That's how we turn right now. If I ask you to do a circle, you pull back with your left rein. The next is an indirect rein. I want you to take your left rein, and I want you to lift it across your horse's neck to the other side of his body. That is an indirect rein. Okay, put it back. We very rarely use this. Just give me the last is an open rein. While you're trotting, I'd like you to take your outside hand, and stick it straight out from the horse's shoulder. So look at me. Take your hand straight out. Good job, Molly. Pull that hand right out. Yeah, keep that one hand straight out. See how much closer he gets to the rail? Okay. So oftentimes if your horse cuts the corner, you can open your rein and indirect rein with the inside and get them in the corner. Together we will move them over. Go ahead and take a walk. So now you understand what I say when I say direct, indirect, or open? Yeah. Okay. What are you doing, Missy? Okay. And I'm using this. So if we get a stool, she spends all her time over here now with Sabrina. Isn't it weird? She got bit by some kind of horsey bug. She like wants to really? take care of her. Yeah, she wants to do everything now. I would say we were good together. Such a good horsey mama. Sophie decided she wants to give Sabrina a little bit of grass. Is it muddy? Just let her stand right at the front here so she doesn't go too far. It's a bit dry here. <laughs> Look, Sabrina, there's grass. This right here. She's like, really? This is not grass. This is all we have right now, Sabrina. We're struggling to find grass because. All the snow is just melted, so we're not even hardly into spring yet. A little bit of grass. Look at that, pretty girl. Sophie groomed her and got lots of bug spray and put it on her. We have like one no, mosquito. I didn't do that much. Oh. Yeah, she put some bug spray on her because um, we had a mosquito. We saw one mosquito today, so you better be safe. She just got the natural stuff that we have. Mm, she smells good with it. That's the sound of a happy horse, huh? Oh, water. I love you, Sophie. You're such a good mama. See, all these hairs are sticking up. I love how you're getting to know her. You're oh, getting, I trust her way more now. You trust her way more now? Yeah. Even why? Because I, I trust her a lot. Now. You know what I think? What? I think you trust you so much more, and that makes you trust her. Do you think you trust yourself more? No. You do, Sophie. You're no. Have, yeah, you're having faith in yourself because you got some thigh muscles now, and you know you okay, can what? stick Are things. Okay, what? All the good grass is over here now. Yeah. Good job. Left leg, left leg, you missed your turn. I noticed, now you gotta make a canter all the way around the arena. Keep your left leg on when you're going down the straight. Left, 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 yeah. Excellent, keep cantering. Nice corner. Switched it halfway through. Try to do it just Get ready to turn. 
Left leg turn, left leg turn, left leg turn. Good. Right leg, kick. Here. Outside leg, keep pushing him. Keep pushing him. Turn to the tunnel. Left leg. Yes, you did it. That was beautiful. Let him walk. Sit, bend your knees. If you stick your feet out in front of you, then you're going to drive your saddle into his shoulders. So you want to bend your knees and grip with your thighs, okay? Pull your horses out, ladies. How was your lesson? Good. Good. Were you happy not to jump today? Not happy. I was okay. What were you learning? Lead changes over poles. Lead changes over poles. Quite do it. Yeah. So, Gabby has a lot of trouble getting Storm to go because he was raised with spurs. So as soon as he was able to be trained as a young horse, they used spurs on him. So he's sort of desensitized to legs and we're working through that and our ultimate goal is to not ever have to use a spur on him our ultimate goal is to have him just a nice going horse like Sabrina because we've never used them on her and we never would um, we had another older rider you guys know her um, ride him and she said she had a really hard time to get him started and so that's what we're working through. And I'll show you guys all that stuff because we only have a few, we only have so many minutes on YouTube each day. And I just don't think it's super interesting for you guys to watch her struggle and struggle and struggle to try and get him going. And I know you guys, a lot of you guys don't believe in spurs, any kind of spurs. And I understand that because I'm not a spur person. But right now, while he's learning to go English and it's a big process learning to go English. Lots of horses go English and Western. Lots of horses do English riding one lesson and then half an hour later they have another lesson with another person and they ride English or Western. They ride Western. So we know he can convert over and he was English before so it's just a big huge process. We want to share the process with you guys because some of you are struggling with the same thing. But you have to know that it's not always going to be perfect. She's not always going to be perfect. He's not always going to be perfect. And he's going to struggle a little because he's not used to this. We're doing this, you guys. We're going on the road. Three horses. You can always see Gabby. She's always got that red shirt on. Oh, it's so neat. My first time riding a horse. This is a dream for me. This is a dream, Gabby. Like, I just can't believe that we're at this spot where you're riding your horse down the road for a little trail ride. That's so nice. Gabby's in love with this. I want to bring Sophia here next time. It was a really long trail ride down the road. This is what I want for summer. This summer we are going to be able to spend a lot of time at the barn and this is what I want. I want to be in shorts and t-shirt and walking with my girls and their horses and I want it to be as relaxing and calm. Like I'm not even riding the horse and I just feel so relaxed and amazing. And I want the, this for us for the summer. Right, so this is going to be our first time leading Storm, look how pretty, to the water and see how he likes it. He's like, I like the grass. You're going back down to eat stuff for honey. Oh, he's, I'll have a drink of muddy water. Oh, he's playing with it. Drink it. That's gross water. This face. Yeah, that's mud. Don't eat, drink that. Don't drink it. Oh, let him drink it. He likes to drink. Play. She wants you to play. 
What do you think? He's like, whoa. Don't get him too wet because it's going to be cold late soon. All right. Let's go. Sabrina was afraid of the water. Was she afraid of it? Yeah, let him eat some grass. Aw, that's so fun. She's smart. She's like, I would never drink that dirty old water. Even when your day starts so terrible, you can always find something to be grateful for and to be happy about. And I want you guys to know that even when it seems like everybody is against you, like everybody, you still have to live your life your way because when you live, when you change so that you can do what everybody else wants you to do, then you're not living your life anymore. And then um, and God has a plan for you and he has a plan for all of us. And that's why it's so important to live your own life your own way. Right, Sabrina? Right? Yeah, see, she shook her head yes. We are home from shopping. The days that we get up and go in the morning and before I even get a chance to clean are the days that drive me the most crazy because we come home to a messy house. But we did come home to some fun things. We came to a parcel here and a parcel here. So we, um, this is in a horse box. So Sam ordered this for Sabrina. Why did we order it for Sabrina? Because it's rain sheet. Yeah, it's a rain <sighs> sheet. So she has a rain sheet right now, but it's her old Dad one. I didn't know this, but um, <coughs> but um, another horse at our barn, Lady, um, the one who kicked Sophia, um, has this rain sheet. Yeah. So Sabrina and Lady. Probably in the same size. Yeah, they're in the same mm -hmm. field. No, same Ladies is probably size. smaller. Anyway, so this is what it looks like. But it's got blue, a really pretty blue. So it's not purple, so we'll be able to use it again. But it's really, really thin. Okay, okay, thin now, now. What it's, size is it? Did he get the right size? It's thin, deep. Yeah, it's, it's like a raincoat, actually. Instead yes. of like the other ones, this is actually like a raincoat. Yes. So even though it's not a day that we ride, we'll probably be going to the barn tonight and helping turn in horses because um, we want to see them, you guys. Like even when we Size don't ride, even when we don't do anything with them, we, like yesterday was, or yeah, yesterday was so much fun with the horses. We just want to be around them and make you feel Black amazing. We also got this package. I want to see. Is this a pillowcase? From Michaela at MT Horses. Some of you guys know that. Um, yeah, I want this pillowcase. It's so cute. It's got horses on it. They're hugging. You? Uh, some of you guys know her. She has a YouTube channel. She actually did a video about us before, or she was like reacting to I one of our do videos. This store on Jump Club on my birthday. <laughs> I want to take paint and paint. Yeah, that would be fun. <laughs> and she's what? She Snacks. sent us all these. Yeah, these horse treats. Um, Are we able to eat them too? They look good enough for us to eat, huh? Let us know in the comments below. Are we allowed to eat them? Uh, he also gave us the um, ingredients and the names of them and these really okay. cool papers. And I'm going to put these out for the for on Gabby's birthday party when I set up the table yeah. with all the food. I'm going to put these out for treats for the horses. <laughs> now anyone in Jump Club can come and use them. I want that. I'd rather clean stalls than... My room. And my own room. My Isn't it room. so cute? Okay, I'm, I'm getting one. it. And what about this I get one? First pick. Mm. She oh, sent us two of everything. And this one oh, says this one should, um, Gone Riding. I think we're gonna put that on our front door. <laughs> yeah, we are. No. Back door. No. Front door. Back door. That's so pretty. It has a nice little horse um on it. What does this say? Love. Love horses. Oh, it's so cute. I love that. Goner. Gabby's is this cute pink one. It's a little unicorn. It's adorable. This is going on the front door, so if you see it, then... Yeah, if you see this sign in our front door, then you know it's our house, and we're not here because we're gone riding, right? Yes. 
Anyway, if any of you guys love what we got today, the treats and the signs and the pillowcases and the bracelets, then you should know that Michaela at MT Horses has her own Etsy shop and it's called Equestrian Box. And some of you guys probably already do know that. And she makes mystery boxes for horses ranging from $30 to $100. This is one of them and she sent it to us and we love it. I'm totally gonna go and check out her Etsy shop and you guys should too. I'm excited, they came at the exact right time for Gabby's birthday party this weekend. Like, look at these little horse treats that have sprinkles on them. Don't you think it would be so cool to be at a birthday party with horses involved and you get to like pick some treats off the table for yourself and a treat for your horse too? I'm really in love with that idea. Thank you, Michaela, so much. Thank you. Today we might help with chores, and if we do, this will be my last time doing chores as a 10 year old. This is the last time you're ever going to see me when I'm 10. Unless you go back and watch the vlogs. The last time I'm holding Macy when I'm 10. Now that I'm going to be 11 tomorrow, that means Macy's going to be 10 in September. Right now, and Macy is 9, but in dog years, she is 76 years old. I know, she's hyper. <laughs> this is it for today's vlog, you guys. We will be back at it tomorrow with a bigger, um, with a regular vlog after everything that's been happening the last couple of days. So many of you guys sent us amazing messages. Young girls telling me about how hate in their life has affected them in such a dramatic way that they've given up horseback riding. Um, people who are saying, use this as a lesson and move forward and make your own path. And so many amazing inspirational things. You guys amaze me. Like I was feeling super down and now I'm feeling super inspired and super motivated to go forward and be a whole new day by day. So hopefully we'll be able to take this experience and let it affect us and change us and change our vlogs so that we're better. Thanks so much for watching. Bye. And don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.